already looked. Out camping again. The legs have finally recovered from the 23 mile stop last weekend on the Sunday. Uh, a couple of us on this camp today, from the first one here. I brought my tarp with me, well, my homemade one, heavy duty one, in that bag down there. Because he's peeing down and expecting to be peeing it down 90% of the night. So, give us a bit of shelter just in case we need it. It's already raining now. Where we are on the original campsite, we have a lot of leaf coverage, a few ferns. So, yeah, just get in here, get a bit of firewood collected. I've already made a start, but I have got underneath all that lot with my bush box today. I do have some dry kindling. Sorry about the camera movements. <laughs> I'm on my selfie stick. So, yeah. yeah, Carl's going to be here in about 90 minutes. Just message me. Sam should be here shortly. So, bring you back when they're here. And we're all set up. And a mooch. Well, that's me all set up anyway. Still waiting for the other two to turn up. Sam and Carl. Yeah, so. My OX ultralight chair. Uh, tonight, well, t yeah, today, tonight, whatever you would want it. I'm in the Nature Hike Cloud Peak 2. I've got my LEX Fathom EV400 sleeping bag, the LEX self inflating pillow. Ethan doesn't really know yet, but I've pinched his Trekology UL80 sleeping pad. <laughs> and underneath that, just an old 2 3 mil, maybe a little bit thicker, camping pad mat underneath so it protects the sleeping pad. <sighs> Yeah. Tonight for my dinner, gourmet, gourmet, meridian, meridian or mediterranean I do apologise, style veg, halloumin cheese, British lamb leg steak with sage and rosemary butter, and I'll top it off, pepper and garlic steak seasoning, so, and obviously in the morning the obligatory all day breakfast and you can't have a good old camp without a few brews and obviously tactical duck standing guard if you know you know if you don't know can't tell you so it's where you originally started camping here so back here it's a bit more protected as I said before so yeah. nice peaceful spot well protected and well sheltered in case it, the evidence do open up so spin you round not that you really want to see my ugly mug yeah so they should be here shortly so when they get here, as soon as they're all set up, bring you back. That's it. Carl and his son's turned up. So Carl's got his Lavoo hot tent. And his lad is in the Banshee 300. That's what Carl brought on our last camp when he was with us before. With the off-grid nomad as well. So take a look around. Let's flip the camera around. <laughs> Yeah, so Lavu hot tent. He's already got his stove going. Do we say? Do we say? Hey boy, all right. <laughs> We're just getting going, aren't we? Yeah, oh, yes. Yeah, me and Sam have already had a dinners. I had a steak again, and me really 
Mediterranean veg. Get around the other side. Can't get through that gap. Too fat, yep, yeah, definitely. <laughs> I'm adding all the food back from last weekend when I burnt it all off. <laughs> That's the last one I made. Okay. Yeah. Aren't you 300? And the 200. That's really impressive. Yeah. <laughs> Can we get in? Yeah. They've got a nice little wood store still there. Yeah. In total, probably about 20 hours ish. But it's a lot of it's blooming times. Yeah. Yeah, it's just kind of a general chit chat, have a good laugh, few bevers. And chill out so I might do a bit more filming don't know yet tactical duck <laughs> yeah so taps up we have just had a bit more of a heavy rain come down so luckily we had it up so, but every time the rain stops all the midges come out little mozzies uh, just on the other side was there, there is a little stream, so I'm going to be expecting it after night until the sun goes down. Yeah, so if anything good or bad happens, bring you back. So, yeah, go have a chilled out time. So, see you in a bit. Fucking trampy bastards. You can carry it in, in your carrier bag. You can carry the fucking thing back out. Dirty, scruffy cunts. We'll pick it up. We'll put it in our bin. We'll take it with us. No need. No fucking need. I don't like swearing on my channel. Because it is mainly like the little man. But dirty, scruffy bastards. So everyone get into bed. It's about just gone eleven o'clock. So I've not really done that much filming. More of a good chilled, relaxed, few babies. So see you in a few photos we'll take them. See you in the morning. And then I go. Packed up, breakfast dad. Leaving no traces normal. <sighs> nice and tidy. Mm, just flip the camera. How was your night, Sam? How was your night? It was quite good actually. Yeah. Yeah, I'm snoring the little head off, but you know, it's all good. <laughs> How was your first wild camp? Right. Slept well. <laughs> How was your night again? His snoring was good. <laughs> <laughs> but yeah, like, good. Loved it. <laughs> snoring like a trooper. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, so. I'm gonna get going now, go home. Scrubbed up, barbecue ready. Yes, I. Night off. Well, not a night, is it? Morning! <laughs>